Alicia's gonna do what Alicia's gonna do in a race. She's got her own plan, you know, and I think Alice was out there just to run and qualify. So I was kind of like watching her and like thinking, stay relaxed, you've got it, don't worry about it. <laughs> Leave those little kitties behind you a little slower now. But it worked out, yeah. I really want to be in this final, so I'm glad to have the opportunity. Now your race, how did it, how did it feel? How did it play out from um, your point of view? It wasn't quite as smooth as yesterday. Obviously when there's like five people contending for three spots instead of three or four, it makes a difference having extra body out there. So, um, yeah, it definitely was a little bit more contact. Um, it's like a little over 150 to go. Sort of had to like push Brenda Martinez a little bit because we were both all over the place and tripping on each other. So, lost a little bit of momentum, but we just really needed that fourth spot so it could be the first one and it could call for it. So. It'll be the key for you in the final. Um, the Olympic trials final. Staying calm. <laughs> And I'm um, just really believing. I think um, we've gotten to this point and sort of have had to question myself a lot of a lot of times in earlier years of what I did, why I wasn't in the final and stuff like that. But um, things are falling into place finally, and I feel like I just gotta believe and be smart, utilize my energy well, and um, just really save it for that last hundred for whatever happens. You did some rabbiting earlier this year. Was that part of the training, or just because of the money, or um, both, or? You know, I was begging to get in the Prefontaine Classic after the field was already set. I'm acting as my own agent this year, so I'm a little bit behind the curve sometimes. Um, so, in the email, I said I'm even willing to rabbit if you'll let me in. He said, you can rabbit, but you can't race. So, I said, okay, I'll still come. It's a good training opportunity. It's a chance to run at Hayward Field and um, run with the people that I was hoping to be running with in this final on Monday. So, it's a good experience. So, yeah. I actually really love rabbiting. It was fun. <laughs> Different perspective, right? Definitely, yeah. I think people always say you feel like you could always finish, finish the race after you get out of the pace that you're maybe not comfortable with, but um, it's good to feel good and just get through half or three quarters of a race and um, feel rearing to go for next time. So, I mean, you did a really good job rabbiting. Alyssa, she said you did a great job. Yeah, it was fun. It was kind of last second. She said right. go faster yeah. and you hit the time. <laughs> well, we had discussed 57. Just go through 57 was the plan. And then under the stadium right before we went out, she was like, oh, yeah, can you do 56? Because I want to go through 56. I'm like, do you want to go through 56 or should I go through 56? And then just to stay in front of her, we went 55 mid. So she's definitely on fire this year. It's so exciting to see. I mean, now in the final, <laughs> it's pretty apparent what she's going to do. Oh, yeah. She's so does that... Good perspective rabbiting help you at all or um, give your own plan when you race? Yeah, I mean, I know I'm not supposed to go out in 55. <laughs> so I think from there, it's just more of a plan of um, racing that next pack. We'll let her do what she wants to do. If we're catching her at the end, that's great. If not, then there's two, three spots. It's number two and number three spot to fill. So. Good luck. Thank you. Thank you.